fact, at 80 years of age, our next guest has captured the nation's hearts. Dementia sufferer Paul Harvey became an internet sensation after he improvised a piece of music on his piano using just four notes. Well, after a campaign from the public, the BBC's Philharmonic Orchestra has turned it into a full orchestral piece and released it as a single, which is currently sitting at number one in the iTunes and Amazon chart. Oh, oh wow. and we're pleased to say that Paul and his son Nick join us now. Good morning. And I don't, I don't know what it is. It just is so emotional. I think that is the power of music. Every time we've listened Look to it this morning, it's just again. Really... That's twice it's, it's got I know. you today. But that is the beauty of music, and that's what it makes you do. It makes you feel, which is so lovely. And we'll, we'll come to that um, in just a moment. Welcome. It's so lovely to have you both here. Um, Nick, your father's talent is incredible. I mean, it's clear for everybody to see and hear there. Yeah. Yes. Awesome. Awesome. So awesome. But tell me exactly what this party trick is, this four notes. Um, I, I remember it from uh, my, my earliest memory. I was probably about nine and dad was teaching at a, at a, a jazz summer school and he said to the assembled students, right, you, give me a note. Uh, uh, G, you, give me a note. Uh, F sharp. And four notes later, he sat at the piano and improvised the most beautiful tune. Afterwards, Everyone rose to their feet, and I was the proudest son alive. And um, uh, I remembered it a few weeks ago. Uh, Dad was um, st struggling a bit with his dementia, and for him, uh, the ultimate therapy is music. Um, I got him to the piano, and uh, I remembered that little party trick. And fortunately for him, for me, for everyone, I recorded it and put it on Twitter, and it kind of went a bit crazy. It, it did yeah, go it did, crazy. It did. Um, we'll, we'll talk about that in just a second because I just want to uh, talk about Paul's piano history because uh, this is a real pedigree here. Concert pianist and composer. Uh, one of the pieces that he's composed is used in the education curriculum now. Um, so why going on to teaching with all of that, um, the possibility of, of you know, being able to do it professionally and being a concert pianist? I, 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 I like uh, I like teaching and uh, bringing people on, you know, and uh, yes, I wasn't too bothered about what I did, you know, but uh, yeah, I, I, I like helping people as far as music's concerned. And that's what I've done all my life. You've certainly done that, so, that's for sure. Even now, even now, helping people, and absolutely. this is this is the, the biggest thing. And it got it's got you twice today oh, already. Oh, it really has got me. It's still right there as well. I feel like any minute. I know you're going to perform for us again. So goodness help me for that moment. Um, it went viral the clip that you that you videoed, and I know they aired it on Radio Four on on World Alzheimer's Day, and then the listeners wanted more from you. And this is where this has grown, and it's been uh, recorded by the the BBC Philharmonic Orchestra, Paul. What was that moment like when you heard that they were going to record with your song? Uh, I was uh, a bit taken aback because I think the BBC Philharmonic is a wonderful orchestra and for them to actually do something with that, uh, that, that those four notes is awesome is the word. <laughs> I mean. Absolutely awesome. It really is. And what is, what is wonderful about this, and we're watching each of those incredible musicians appear before our eyes right now playing your music, all of them in lockdown, all of them currently paused, all of these musicians unable to be where they would normally be, playing where they would normally play. And so not only have you um, managed to get your song to number one, but also you have incorporated all these brilliant musicians and that must feel incredible. Yeah, well, it's, it, it was a great honour that they were involved and uh, Every time I hear that arrangement that was done by, you know, by them, I just, you know, I well up a bit. I get a little bit emotional because <laughs> it's very special arrangement. So does Holly. We've lost her again. <laughs> I'm so embarrassed. I don't know what's happened. It just won't stop. <laughs> That's all right. That's OK. <laughs> Oh, Sorry. Um, we get, we, um, good, let's finish her off properly. Um, oh let, can I'm going to get you... my box of tissues. Oh, no. <laughs> get the box, get the box. Can I, um, Paul, can I give you... Go on. This um, single um, is uh, all the proceeds from the single are being split 50-50 between the Alzheimer's Society and Music for Dementia. So that it's, it's going to such a great cause and we're really, really grateful for everyone who's downloaded it and buying it and streaming it. Thank you. Absolutely. Well, um, can I can I give you four notes, Paul? Yes. 
Please is that, do. Yeah? OK. <laughs> um, can, can I give you um, A, F, D and B? Right. Absolutely I beautiful. wish we could hear more people applauding. That was beautiful. Well done. You, um, you have, um, Nick, you've said that, that music is keeping... You guys are so close. Um, and it's actually keeping the spark, um, the flame lit. Totally. Um, the power of music transcends everything. Uh, if Dad doesn't want to play the piano, sometimes I'll play him a piece that I know it, it resonates with him from the past. It might be a Stephen Sondheim song from one of the shows and it'll bring him back to the room. If, he, if he's having one of his bad days, nothing is more healing than music with Dad. And I think from all the replies I've had from numerous people over the past um, couple of weeks since this took off, you don't have to be a virtuosic pianist or composer to be able to get those healing effects from music. The right piece of music at the right time is transformational. And Nick, will you keep posting uh, videos of your dad? Of course, oh my word. I'll tell you what, we, we could really release a whole album of four note improvisations. So <laughs> one a month, 12 months from now, number one worldwide, I reckon. I think that sounds like the best plan. Definitely. Are you, uh, are you up in. for that, Paul? <laughs> I'm not sure about that. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you've got two, you've got two people who will certainly buy that. That's Absolutely. for sure. Yeah. Um, it's been uh, been a real pleasure to talk to you. Thank you so much. Uh, just showing us now the the power of music, which we we'll, we're all going to need uh, from uh, from Thursday once again. Uh, so uh, so thank you to to both of you. Stay well. Thank and, you. Uh, we'll look forward to the next post. Thank you. Thank you. Paul. Take care. Thank Thanks, you so Nick. much.